VidCon Day 2. What up though guys, it's me, Fashan Vega, and this is Hey By Design, a YouTube channel where we explore what is design, who are designers, who is it for, and who needs it most. Today is another recap of VidCon 2018. We're going to go over meeting a few new people, something cool that VidCon did that they didn't have to do, but they should have did, and they did, and I want to commend them for that. And lastly, we go on a little hunt for Shambuti. Oh, and how did I forget the DJI Ronin S? So the second day of VidCon 2018 was actually the first day of tracks by different content creators from around the world giving us their advice and perspective on different topics as far as producing YouTube channels, content creation, quality, outreach, engagement, all those cool different forms that encompass or is the process of being a good YouTuber. So the first track I went to, it was packed, really good information, but after I got what I needed it was some other stuff that I needed to go do and I wanted to leave something told me not to and I didn't and in line I ran to my friend I had met the day before do legacy Hello. hi how's it going <laughs> D, D over from do legacy how you doing still I'm in line and a part of me is like hey man you need to get to that other track but another part of me was like positioning myself in the room with 150 people asking a good question, getting some information back for myself, giving some information for the other people, and also having the ability to put my name out there, say my name, the YouTube channel, hopefully get a few new subscribers and friends, and also become aware to the celebrities that were on stage. Lo and behold, that actually worked out for me. So, super happy I stayed, I was going to leave, but I didn't. And they got to ask my question, get some advice, get a little bit of exposure. That's really, I'm happy. I'm happy with the end result. That's just like using your intuition to make sure that you're in the right place at the right time. Remember, position is everything when it comes to strategy. So VidCon did this thing where they had a track for black creators. I'm like, that's pretty solid of VidCon in YouTube to understand the importance of representation and identity and the fact that they dedicated a room and a time slot for all the black creators who had came into a predominantly white space and said, we acknowledge you we acknowledge your community, we acknowledge your identity, and here's a space where you, your culture, and others outside of your culture and your identity can come and experience each other, exchange energy, learn, connect, communicate, build. A lot of the people that I saw in the Black Creator track I actually never saw outside of it because VidCon was humongous. We had if you like 10,000 people or something like that. It was really dope to meet these guys. Here's one of them. Hey, you the day, my man? Look, hey. Listen, do y'all see my man with the tie tag right here? Hey. You dig what I'm saying? Hey. My man's sharp. Clearly you know what he's talking just about. Get the, my man's sharp, this is how you gotta be. Y'all see that? Hey, you know, I'm just trying to do a little song. I'm just trying to be humble in these streets, man. Man, just tell me a little bit about yourself, man. Well, my name is E. Dean Cole, and I own Dean Cole Financial. It's a consulting firm that specializes in working capital and business credit development. I'm a YouTuber, life coach. My YouTube channel is hashtag money making motivation. E. Dean Cole on YouTube. Subscribe, I go live where I take your questions, I answer your questions on how to start a business, how to fix your credit, and that's what we do. What about you, my man? Besides being super clean and sharp. He's fresh, go follow him. I wanna give a big shout out to VidCon for doing that. Keep that up, that's dope. If you were there, you were in that room, comment below. And if you're interested in ever being in that room, comment below. DJ, I had a booth and I think the first actual release like video by DJI on YouTube was like maybe a few days before VidCon. So you walk into the supplier's domain and product domain of VidCon, you got Rode, Mike, shout out to Rode, and DJI. And I'm like, 
Ronin S. I'm playing with this thing. It is phenomenal. Not only is it just super sweet, it says that it can hold a certain weight. I'm convinced it could hold more. What? That's crazy. But not only did we meet the guys at DJI and play with some toys, we met the guys at TubeBuddy. Let me tell you a little bit more about TubeBuddy and why I think it's relevant. If you watch Daryl Eves, you've heard of TubeBuddy. Here we have James, one of the co-founders of TubeBuddy. He's gonna tell us a little bit of why you probably wanna use this service. James? Yeah, all right, I can jump in. So it kind of depends on your channel. If you're a smaller channel, we've got tools in there to help you do tag research, help you grow your channel, figure out you know what keywords are good for your specific channel to target and search based on your channel size. If you're a bigger creator, then I'd recommend some of the bulk tools. We got tools that you can use to automatically update all your past videos. So you put out a new video, you wanna um, add a card to all your past videos to point to that new video, drive some traffic to it. We've got a bulk tool that you can use to, uh, to do that with one click instead of spending days. And then the other tool that I'd really suggest is the A-B test tool. So you can try out different thumbnails, look at the click-through rate and say, hey, you know, if, if video A gets me a 5% click-through rate, video B gets me a 10% click-through rate, you just doubled your, your views right there by choosing the better thumbnail. That's value. And yeah. you know, Daryl and other YouTubers talk about how important thumbnails are. Oh yeah, I mean that's what that's what everybody's seeing. You know, you're in competition against everyone else in the search results, everyone else in related. If you've got that better thumbnail, you're gonna get the click. Where can we go to download or use TubeBuddy? All right, so TubeBuddy is a browser extension. It means you install it, and then all our tools will show up when you're on YouTube. So if you go to TubeBuddy.com and download the browser extension, you're set. And we really try and do good support. So just contact us if you have any questions, YouTube related or TubeBuddy related. That. I, I'm doing it. You should do it. Peace. So basically what TubeBuddy is, is a plugin for your computer that pretty much gives you data on your YouTube channel, how it's performing, how people are interacting with it, and possibly giving you feedback on what you should probably do based on this information. It's actually a pretty awesome tool and it's free. It does some more things, but for the average YouTuber, until you get into a certain bracket of subscribers and income, the free version is fantastic. Matter of fact, I think until you hit a certain threshold of subscribers, you're not even able to tap into particular functions all right i think that wraps it up for us today uh we no no it doesn't second day at vidcon i went on a hunt for shambuti as you guys know from the previous video i won a private session uh, with a very small group of youtubers to meet shambuti today second day of vidcon was her first day of speaking engagements. I was hoping to bump into her and at the very least, figure out where the heck her panel was. Well, I found her. Found Shane Boutry. Um, this is a question. Design the fam one, just a little bit. Let's go. And in the process, I actually took some pictures that I think she ended up using uh, for social media. And Here's that. So yeah, I got kind of close to Shan Booty that first day. I was able to take some really dope pictures of her and her friends. The information, the topic that they were talking about was extremely relevant, cool. Bunch of people there, which was dope. Ironically, that was the same stage that Casey Neistat spoke on. That was the first day meeting him, but that's for another recap. Just a quick recap of today, we explored meeting new people, running the sham booty, using our intuition to make sure that we make good decisions even when we're scared, even when we're uncomfortable, even when we think we should be moving in one direction, but we feel pulled towards another one. It usually benefits us. So, it's looking about that time, and I'd like to thank you for yours. Please like, share, and subscribe if you haven't already. Be sure to ring the notification bell to stay up to date with future vlogs, Tip Minute Tuesdays, episodes, and gifts. Follow me on Instagram and Twitter. Twitter is where I rant. Instagram is where I show my creative side. Design is human, put humans first. Define, design, repeat. Almost forgot again. As always, follow everybody in Decoy. Links under this video. 
Decoys, Detroit conglomerate of YouTubers. That's a group of YouTubers in Detroit who are from Detroit around Detroit with different perspectives and giving you the real inside scoop on what's happening in Detroit. Peace.